All right, I got 615. We'll go ahead and call to order the regular meeting of the Prairie Municipal Authority uh, for June 3rd, 2013. Roll call, please. Streller. Here. Webb. Here. Moxley. Here. Johnson. Here. Norman. Here. Nation. Wade. Here. Warner. Here. Paul. Here. We do have a quorum present. Uh, at this time, we have uh, Clydeen, did I say it right? Clydeen Williams uh, to give our opening prayer for us. It's an honor and a privilege to be here today and be asked to do this. So if you would please just join with me and bow your heads as we offer up this to the Lord. Father God in heaven, we give you praise and thanksgiving for our great city of Perry, Oklahoma, <coughs> for those you have placed in authority over us. We now lift up our honored mayor and our city manager, our city clerk and council members, and we bring them before your throne, asking that as your ministers of righteousness, you would fill their hearts and their minds with wisdom, your understanding and ability to govern our fair city according to your precepts that we might dwell in peace, harmony, and protected from evil. We now declare that your kingdom come and your will be established in Perry, Oklahoma, that it and all its citizens may bring you glory and be blessed and empowered to prosper above all the cities of our great nation. And we ask these things in the precious name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Thank you. All right, uh, at this time we'll move to the uh, consent agenda. Item number one, items wish to be removed. We'll take those. Seeing none, motion being ordered to approve. So motion to approve. The motion is second to approve the consent agenda as presented. Will there be discussion? Questions or comments? Roll call, please. Strahler? Yes. Webb? Yes. Moxley? Yes. Johnson? Yes. Norman? Yes. Wade? Yes. Warner? Yes. Paul? Yes. Now we move to comments from those assembled. Anybody wish to make comments on items not on our PMA agenda? We'll take those from you. Comments from those assembled? Comments from those assembled. Now proclamations, commendations, reports, inquiries of the governing body. Seeing none, we'll move to item number six, new business. This could be a record. Two minutes. Item number seven. Motion to adjourn. Second. Okay, motion to second to adjourn. Roll call, please. Strong. Yes. Yes. Webb. Moxley. Yes. Johnson. Yes. Norman. Yes. Wade. Yes. Warner. Yes. Paul. Yes. Okay, I'll call to order the regular meeting of the City Council of City of Perry. It's June 3rd, uh, 617. Roll call, please. Streller. Here. Webb. Here. Moxley. Yes. Johnson. Yes. Norman. Here. Nation. Wade. Here. Warner. Here. Paul. Here. We do have a quorum present at this time. We'll move to item number one, the consent agenda. Oh, Items wishing to be removed. Motion to approve. Second. We have a motion second to approve the consent agenda. And will there be discussion? Seeing none, votes in order. Strahler? Yes. Webb? Yes. Moxley? Yes. Johnson? Yes. Norman? Yes. Wade? Yes. Warner? Yes. Paul? Yes. Now we move to item number four, comments from those assembled. Anybody wishing to make comments on items not on our city council agenda, we'll take those from you. Comments from those assembled? Oh, you're good. Comments from those assembled? Seeing none, we'll move to item number five, proclamations, commendations, reports, and inquiries. I'd like to say something for the uh, uh, city uh, staff uh, of the uh, cemetery and parks department groups. Wow. Uh, the cemetery looked great. The, the bedding around town looks great. The parks are looking real good. And I know it's called the rain. We've got some beautiful green grass, but it just, over the holiday, is just exceptional. I'm very proud. Thank you. Thank you. I, I agree. It was a uh, Super Bowl award again. <laughs> Any other uh, combinations, reports, and inquiries? Seeing none, we'll move to item number six, which is conduct a public hearing on a 2013-2014 budget. Uh, this is something that we uh, do annually. It's been posted. Uh, at this time, we will convene the public meeting uh, on the fiscal year 2013-2014 budget. Meredith, you want to run us through the highlights? Absolutely. All right, so we had the budget session. Everyone was here. I got to sit in the back. Make sure Russ didn't mess up our budget. But changes that were made based upon that from the budget meeting include um, the capital outlay requests that were uh, removed and added based upon uh, what Mary had recommended. So um, what we have with, what we have now is a balanced budget. General Fund is showing a net change of 
at $4,995,000, at $4,995. Consider that basically a break-even budget. Um, net increase in utility fund, $196,000 and some change. Grand total for all the funds, $212,000 is what we'll be carrying over for next year. Um, in this budget, as we've discussed, taxes are budgeted at 90%. That'll generate about $100,000 if collections come in, consistent with what um, this year has been. 3.5% pay rate increase for um, employees, totaling about $103,000 is in the budget. Health insurance increase of 12%, direct pass through that we're expecting from our health insurance company, $86,000. The fire department um, from the state law has increased our requirement for their retirement of 1%. That's included in the budget. Capital projects, as we discussed in length at the meeting, $534,000 in the general fund. PMA has $577,000. Airport has $48,000 for a total of $1.1 million in capital projects included in this budget. Also included in this budget is the seasonal rate increases that we discussed. So for the, for the two hottest months, um, July and August, when bills are the highest, we're seeing a 1% decrease in the utility rate. Either 10 months of the year have reflected a 3.75 increase. That will generate about $105,000 per percentage. That gives us a balanced budget. Uh, at this time, uh, we will accept comments from the public. Comments from the public on the proposed budget. Comments from the public. If you are watching at home, the seats are empty. There's uh, no, no public here except for city, city staff, the council, newspaper. <clears throat> Comments from the public? Comments from the public? <laughs> this is the best budget hearing yeah. I've been through in two years. Well, if somebody's coming in the door, you made somebody mad. All right, all right. Should I come in? Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't care. He's not from the public. <laughs> All right, uh, what we'll do uh, is we'll, uh, before we adjourn the public meeting, uh, we'll uh, announce to everybody that uh, this council will, uh, uh, will address the uh, budget yes, yet again on uh, our June 17th meeting. Uh, that gives us time uh, if there's issues that need to be addressed uh, or concerns if the budget can't be passed as presented to uh, conduct a special meeting if we need to. Uh, so that the budget does get some, so that a budget does get approved by July 1st. Uh, with uh, with that and no further comments from the public, uh, we will adjourn the public meeting. We'll adjourn the public <coughs> meeting on uh, the 2013-2014 budget. All right, we'll move to item number seven: authorized payment on retainage to contractor on Perry Runway Rehab Project. Mary finished the contractor has done everything that he needs to do both from the work at the physical work at the airport all the paperwork has been completed the engineering firm has signed off and so um, at this time we're ready to, to pay um, the contractor the retainage and I we would recommend that what would you like to do with it move to approve we have a motion to second to approve the payment of the retained fee to the contractor on the Perry Runway Rehabilitation Project. Will there be discussion? Questions? Comments? Do we have questions? Yes. Comments. Any additional questions? Yes, we have two vote. John Strohler. Yes. Webb. Yes. Moxley. Yes. Johnson. Yes. Norman. Yes. Nation. Yes. Wade. Yes. Warner. Yes. Paul. Yes. Now we'll move to item number eight, which is consider approval of uh, Gary May and Tom Davis to conduct their annual fireworks display at the Perry Lake on July 4th, 2013. Council members, of course, uh, the team of May and Davis have done this for a number of years, have done a good job. They go around and uh, hold their hand out and take collections to uh, make this possible. Uh, they uh, both, uh, they put up uh, insurance uh, and they have both gone to uh, training uh, to uh, to allow them to purchase these uh, these big fireworks for displays. So, 
Gary said that he'd be pleased to be here tonight. Uh, I didn't think that we'd have uh, much of an issue with this. We all look forward to it, but uh, it's here for your authorization. I'd like a motion to approve. Thank you, Tim. Second by Bill. Discussions? Questions? Okay, let's move to a vote. Strawler? Yes. Webb? Yes. Moxley? Yes. Johnson? Yes. Norman? Yes. Nation. Yes. Wade. Yes. Warner. Yes. Paul. Yes. Now we move to item number nine. City manager comments. Uh, Gordon took one of my comments, uh, but <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry I'm, about that. I will uh, go ahead and say um, I agree. The parks, the planting beds around the square, cemetery, uh, everything is looking very nice. The rain has helped a lot, but it's you know it took some hard work. And um, I would say the employees take great pride in the work that they've done and what they've accomplished. And uh, so for it to be noticed, uh, that, makes, that means a lot. So thank you for that. Uh, last week, had, a, uh, had some rain last week. And uh, that was good, maybe good news and bad news, possibly, uh, as much rain as we got. Uh, does point out, uh, painfully points out the um, need for some infrastructure work in our community. And, um, and also now that it's rained, our engineer uh, will be able to finish the sanitary sewer master plan. So I'm, uh, he's on, uh, plans to be in my office on Friday and we'll be talking about that uh, uh, when that can be completed and presented to the council. So um, we look forward to that. Uh, we did have a few uh, emergency call-outs uh, uh, because of the, of the storm uh, with some sewer problems. And uh, that's never a pleasant thing uh, for the homeowners. And uh, so uh, it's one of those things that uh, does happen sometimes when we have a, a downpour of rain. Uh, I don't know what the actual, you know, how much rain Perry actually received, but I know it was in excess of six or seven inches, I think. Some places, maybe more. So, anyway, uh, like I say, uh, does uh, remind us that uh, we have work to do. And uh, we'll be back on that. Uh, uh, one of the things I think I commented on uh, was that the sanitary sewer master plan uh, you know, will be completed. And currently, there is no money in the budget to actually do any of the work that will be recommended, but we'll be addressing that uh, at the time whenever um, the engineer is ready to make that presentation to the council. And with that, I'd answer any questions if anyone has any. Questions of Mary? Okay, we'll move to item number 10, new business. Any new businesses come before us? Seeing none, we'll move to item number 11, which is considered convening the executive session to discuss negotiations on level 4242 of the IAFF and the FOP number 137 pursuant to 25 OS 307B2. That'll be the only discussions taking place in executive session. What would you like to do? So moved. Second. We have a motion and second to convene into executive session. Roll call, please. Yes. Webb? Yes. Moxley? Yes. Johnson? Yes. Norman? Yes. Nations? Yes. Wade? Yes. Warner? Yes. Yes. Okay, I entertain a motion to reconvene. So moved. Okay. We have a motion and a second to reconvene into regular oh. session. Let's go to a vote. Streller? Yes. Webb? Yes. Moxley? Yes. Johnson? Yes. Norman? Yes. Nation? Yes. Wade? Yes. Warner? Yes. Call? Yes. Any action needs to be taken as a result of executive session? Seeing none, let me take a mayor's privilege real quick before we move to item number 14 and simply say uh, we're all looking forward to doing something with the budget at our June 17th meeting. If you have questions, if you have comments, if you have concerns, please relay them to Mary between now and the 17th so that we can address those, okay? We'll move to item number 14. Push to adjourn. Second. We have motion second to adjourn. Let's move to a vote. Streller? Yep. Webb? Yes. Moxley? Yes. Johnson? Yes. Norman? Yes. Nation? Yes. Wade? Yes. Warner? Yes. Paul? Yes. Very good.